Hello everyone, thank you for joining on this today's video session. So this is the 1st of February 2021 on this Thursday. So today, on Thursday, usually I do the live streams, but today I decided to do a recorded video session because I had things to do at night in Japan time. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video session. On this Ichimoku Five Lines Analysis. So, before starting here, just a quick disclaimer. This information is basically based on my experience knowledge. So, when you take trades, please do with your own risk. All right. So, um, let me talk about the essence of Five Lines and which which pair, or which market to look at to take trades or not. So first, um, so this is like the holistic analysis in the market by Ichimoku Five Lines, but I think this is a great opportunity to talk about this topic for today's analysis because I see this Euro CAD, Euro JPY, Euro Pound, and Euro AUD. These Euro pairs has been quite interesting setups to, for example, of my analysis. So let me talk about this market today, and hopefully you learn how to, uh, which I mean how to capture trending market and range market, and what you can expect to look for the sell chance and buy chance in shorter term. So here we see Euro CAD daily chart, and on this Euro CAD daily chart, what do you see here now? Do you think this is trending down or up or ranging by five lines of Ichimoku? What do you think is it right now? Um, you can look at this price action in candlestick patterns, but um, I would like to focus on this Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, and Chiko Span and Kumo angles, Senko Span B and A angles at the moment. So, in this case, I would not look for any buy or sell chances. Basically, I stay away on this daily chart and simply because right now the Kumo flat. Right now the Kumo has been flat and also Kijun Sen has been all completely flat at the moment. And Chikou spun below the candles, so this is a nice downtrend confirmation. But at the moment, we see this uh, Kumo flat, the Kijun Sen flat, and we see pin bars over here. We see two two pin bars at the moment, so I can see that there is a strong support level over here at this 1.5336 level. So the market might go up, and it might come back to Kijun Sen or the Senko Span B. So to me. This is a range market, so I won't look for any buy or sell chances at the moment on the daily chart. And now you might think that so the if you look at the single span A, so single span A is a lower part of the bearish kumo, single span B is upper part of the bearish kumo. And if you see the single span A, it's going down. So and also Tenkan Sen is going down and Chikou Span below the candles. So, you might think that this might be downtrending in the short term, so it might go down this way, you might think like this way. But for me, it's not true. Because you have to see the bigger picture, and in the bigger picture, you see the Kumo has been flat. I mean, Senko Span A is at the moment going downwards. However, the overall Kumo has been flat, and Senko Span A has been retracing backwards and single span B is flat at the moment. So to me, this is flat ranging market and I won't look for any buy or sell chances at the moment. So let me show you another example where there is a strong downtrending at the moment. So I think the good, good example for the downtrend it will be a Euro Pound. So unlike Euro CAD pair, if you can compare, if you can remember this picture, Kumo and Kijun Sen angle, 
10 counts and chikou span angles, locations. And please remember this screenshot if you can uh, take a little bit of time to remember this chart. And I will switch it to Euro Pound at the moment. And you see a huge difference. And so th to me, this is range. But let me change it to Euro Pound daily chart. Same time frame, but different pair. So here we go. Euro Pound. So you can clearly see that this is different. And now I think that this is downtrending. So this is a pair that I look for the sell chance. And simply because the Kumo has been downtrending. And precisely the Senkospan B is flat. But Senkospan A is going down at the moment. And Senkospan A has been going down. Senkospan A has been going down. And it is going down at the moment. Progressive, progressive going down. And also, Kijun Sen is going down. Tenkan Sen is also going down. And Chikou Span is exactly below the candles. So in this state, this is a clear downtrend. So I continue to look for the sell chance. So if you compare this chart with Euro CAD, when you see it, I think the, you can see the clear difference. So once again, Euro CAD is flat because Kumo flat, Kijun Sen flat overall. But if you see Euro Pound, this is downtrending. So every time I look at the charts, uh, Euro Pound is the one. I mean, this, this kind of market is the one that I look for the sell chance. But if I see this kind of market, Euro CAD, I won't look at it on that day. Because most likely within the, within the day, on the daily chart, it's flat. So I don't want to take time to look at this chart for the time efficiency to the market. So looking at this Euro Pound again, it's downtrending because the Senko Span A down, Kijun Sen Tenkan Sen down, and Chikou Span below the candles. And so until when I look for the sell chance, and let me talk about this topic next. So now this is going down and I look for the sell chance. But yesterday and today are basically these bullish trends, uh, bullish candles. So now it's retracing backwards. It's retracing backwards this way. But at this moment, I expect the market to continue to go down this way. And that will be when the market is being is going to be resisted by this Tenkan Sen and it goes down this way. And let me tell you the reason why I expect this move. And simply because it's been a part in the market. Because if you look at the past on the chart, since this 22nd of January and 25th, 26th, and also 28th and 29th of January last month, the market has been resisted by this Tenkan Sen and it's going down this way. And it's been a pattern on the market, on the daily chart. So I expect when the market touches on this Tenkan Sen next time, I expect the market will be resisted by this Tenkan Sen, probably weak point upwards in the previous charts, and the market goes down this way continuously. Then I look for the sell chance by looking at the lower time frames. And so from this reason, I look for the sell chance on the daily chart and onwards. However, if I see, first time, if I see the market will be uh, violating this Tenkan Sen and it goes up this way, then I won't look for the sell chance anymore. Because now, if I see this pattern, if I see the breakout of the Tenkan Sen in the future, that means the market has been violating this resistance of Tenkan Sen on the daily chart and now it's going upwards. So if I see that happens first time in the future, then I won't look for the sell chance anymore. But as long as the market has been resisted by this Tenkan Sen, 
and I expect I look for the sell chance continuously by looking at the lower time frames. So, and I expect the market has been resisted by this Tenkan Sen and going downwards this way simply because I see the downtrend on the Kumo and also the Kijun Sen at the moment and Chikou Spoon below the candles also. And that's why I expect this continuous downtrend at the moment on the daily chart. And these are the things that I always look at the market and look for these confirmations. So for example, uh, on this Euro AUD, I won't look for the sell chance in simply because now, uh, yes, the Kiyun Sen is going down and Chikou Span below the candles. However, I see the Kumo flat at the moment. So unless I see Kumo downtrending, I won't look for the sell chance. So now, you might think that the market has been resisted by this Kijun Sen once and twice and three times recently and it going down this way. So you might think that next time when the market touches on this Kijun Sen, it bounces this way and going down this way. But I don't think this way because now the Kumo is flat. So when Kumo becomes flat, um, the market can penetrate this Kijun Sen uppers and I won't look for the tail chance anymore. And because the Kumo flatness is uh, at the moment visible, I expect the market might be uh, breaking this Kijun Sen uppers. So to make the long, to make the long story short, I won't look for the sell chance on this one, on this pair, on Euro AUD daily chart, simply because the Kumo is flat, I mean Senko Span B flat and Senko Span A is also flat. So the market might violate the Kijun Sen upwards this way. But uh, if you look at once again this Euro pound, it is downtrending. I can see the Senko Span B flat, but A is down and Kijun Sen down and also Chikou Span downwards at the moment. So in this pattern and also I see the market has been resisted by this Tenkan Sen. So in case next time when the market touches on this Tenkan Sen, it can bounce and go down this way continuously is my expectation and that's why I would rather uh, to pick up this Euro Pound daily chart and look for the sell chance than Euro AUD or other pairs that are flat at the moment. So hopefully um, you can uh, capture whether the market is racing backwards or ranging or downtrending or uptrending by using the five lines because this is very important and if you can realize the fact that these five lines can tell you exactly which way the market is trending, then uh, it becomes very powerful to to uh, to capture that market trending, and also it saves time because you know at a glance you know whether the market ranging or trending up or downwards on these forex pairs. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you liked it, please press a good button and make sure to subscribe and click the bell button so you get notified as I do these live videos every day on different topics. So once again on Thursdays and Fridays usually I do the live stream but because of these personal reasons sometimes I do the video session. Today was a video session so I hope you enjoy the live and video sessions in the future and learn the essence of the Ichimoku and if you like to know the depths, more deeper level of Ichimoku knowledge, then I run the Ichimoku community here. So you can always click the join button on YouTube and you can join the Ichimoku community of mine to, to learn the essence of five lines and also three theories, wave theory, time theory and price theory and also Qshlex on this Ichimoku community onwards. So I hope you have a great, great day today. I hope you can catch some trends this week and onwards. So until I see you next time, please stay healthy and stay gold. Matane. Thank you.
Matane means see you in Japanese. So, Matane. See you. Bye for now.